welcome to the new Star Trek game. Oh yes, I love the soundtrack to this game. Right, so good news, this can be can play, this can be complete. This can be played from my Xbox controller, which is plugged in. So let's just, first things first, turn up aim speed. Aim assist, yeah, let's just keep it on. I'm a noob. Oh, I love the sound. Oh no, wait a minute. Graphic settings. Ah, this is literally the, I've literally just opened up this game. Quality. Hi. Hi. Um. Ooh. Nothing broke. We're okay. Ooh, that was a little jolty. Ooh. There we go. It's not so clunky anymore. Right, so, new game. Um, medium, yeah. Woo. Choose your character. Chirk, 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 or Spock? Big choice, big choice, big choice, big choice. All guns blasting, or I'm a Vulcan? Um, I'm gonna go Spock, because he is freaking epic. Tactical, precise, and logical. That sounds like not very me. I'm gonna play offline because I'm I I got no friends. So yeah, gonna play offline. Ambush. Oh. Black screen. Oh. Oh. Um. Um. I haven't explained. Oh, to the left. Okay, so we're going. Oh, we go Gears of War, are we? Captain, grenade! Wait, what? I'm confused. How do we end up here? One of those things. <coughs> Hi there, Spock. How are you? You look good. Oh, Spock looks pissed. Oh, Kirk looks pissed. Wait, so what? what's gone on? I haven't explained anything. I'm confused. Has any of this made sense yet? It is your move, Captain. I'm aware of that, Mr. Spock. Oh, eight hours earlier. Damn it! Your choice was valid, Captain but highly predictable. Predictable? Since when have I ever been predictable? That is precisely why the move was predictable, Captain. Another Captain, we have received an emergency signal from a nearby space station. Please report to the bridge at once. Shall we finish the game later, or do you concede defeat? <laughs> you should know me better than that by now, Spock. I never concede. Okay. So, so far the voice acting sounded Half decent, I guess. Right, oh, the whoa, okay. Use left trigger to direct for. Oh. I await your orders, Captain. No, I don't. Piss off. Run away. Did you try reversing the phase oscillation? That's the first thing I tried. Oh, the Stop. phase oscillation. Commander? Chief? I just got the results of those scans. Good work, Ensign. Where's Kirk? This way, Captain. Wow, Kirk's a moron. Ooh, hi there. I'm just gonna scan you. Yeah, I trust you, Kirk. 
Um, how do I scan? Scan, scan. This way. There's the bridge. The bridge. Yes, that's the bridge. Wow, they're using players as walls. Nice. This door. This is M six one one zero. Yay! Ooh, what's this? What's going on down there? Lucas on the, the bridge. The radiation from those binary stars is making communications Wee. difficult. But the station appears to be in some oh. sort of distress. No. Hmm. Check off readings. They are operating on emergency power and are starting Oh, Chekhov's voice out. sounds awesome. Call? It sounds exactly Unknown. like Chekhov. Captain, they have issued a request for immediate evacuation. Then let's help them out. Mr. Scott, prepare transporters. I wouldn't recommend it, sir. Those stars are giving off too much interference. <laughs> Unless we achieve manual luck, we might fry those little guys. <laughs> let's do it. Try them. them. The mm, food. Prepare my shuttle. Meet me in the bay. Aye, aye, sir. Captain, in spite of your seemingly endless desire to stretch your legs, I must remind you that you are still a Starfleet captain. This is clearly a job that Mr. Scott and a few ensigns could handle. But then I'd miss all the fun. Sir, the more prudent choice would be to stay on the Enterprise and wait for a response to our hails. Oh, you're right. Lieutenant Uhura, any response to our hails? None, sir. Well, looks like I'm going. <laughs> uh, where are you going? He really liked that girl, didn't he? Captain. I will follow your lead, Captain. Come on. Come on. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting. I'm a well Captain, done. You must insist. You insist? You know what, Mr. Spock? A change of scenery might do you some good, Captain. You come with me. That's quick. Your shuttle's ready, Captain. But do you think it's wise to go yourself? McCoy? I'm sure me and some no. troops could handle this. Don't worry, Scotty. We'll be fine. Always makes me nervous when he says that. We'll be fine, he says. Wow, we've just gone from like the bridge to the back end ass of the ship in like 10 seconds. They haven't explained how to sprint. What, what sprint? I don't know how to sprint. How do I sprint? Do, do. I'm already loving the music. The music sounds good. Wow, that noise was us changing into these suits. Oh yeah. Hello, there is a boom. Wow. Enterprise shuttle confirming approach at five by six. There's the Enterprise. You can't see me, but I'm touching my screen. There's Enterprise. WTF is that thing? The little space station would have been fried by those two stars by now. What the hell are they doing out there? Captain, Being the clever. station appears to be outfitted with solar collectors, but they are unlike any I have ever encountered. Wow. Mr. Sula, do you have any clue what an experimental power station would be doing out here in the middle of nowhere? Negative, Captain. Making power? Whatever they're doing, Starfleet doesn't have any record of it. Preparing Obviously. Obviously making power. Quite obvious what they're doing. They're making power. No? I thought so. Ooh. Running, Drifting Sula, sideways. Whoa, vibrating controller. Wow. We have landed. Right, right, right. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa, okay. Um, phaser. That. We I can jump now. Can I sprint? How do I sprint? Ooh. Radiation scan commencing. Please step forward for decontamination. Whoa. Whoa. Surprise! Officer, where is the captain of this station? This way. You must hurry. Or not. Bet that hurt. Damn it. Is this Jump, the fun spot. you were afraid you were going to miss, Captain? Yep. Right. We need to get everyone out of here right away. Captain, um. we must find an alternate route. Very perceptive, Mr. Spock. Can I jump these? Whoa. Vault object. Wow. 
X to enter. Wow, you have to do a whole button press to enter event. Wait, what? Captain, we're picking up some strange. <laughs> there appears to be some sort of anomaly. What? That was miles away. We have our hands full. Anything we need to worry about right now? The readings are off the charts, sir, but I don't think so. We'll just keep an eye on it, Mr. Chekhov. Aye, aye, sir. Mr. Chekhov. <sighs> Yay! Open sesame. You're in the way, sir. You're in the way, sir. I await your orders, Captain. No, I don't. He seems to be choking. And now he's dead. He's stuck in there. Let's get him out of there. We I might. The door can be hacked from this side. Ooh, this side. Use a tricorder. Unlock. Oh, really? That was hacking. Wow, that was um, that was brilliant. That was like the best. Oh, you're fine now. <sighs> I am in your debt. Are you okay? Formalities are unnecessary. Please proceed Hack. to the shuttle bay for immediate evacuation. Oh, actual hacking. Captain, I must mention that many of these crew members appear to be Vulcan. Your point. With fewer than ten thousand Vulcans remaining, I question the logic of placing them on any type of experimental power station. I question putting anybody on this thing, Mr. Spock, Vulcan or not. Agreed, sir. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. That didn't even explain what I had to do. I get Kirk to hack it. It would be best served hacking the console. I'll hack this console. Anna, come, Kirk. I believe in you. Hey, well done, Kirk. Wait, what? But didn't we have to go anywhere from here? No. I thought we were going to do something fun. Obviously not. Star Trek game. You don't do anything fun. I'm Spock. The most fun I have is running through these. Whee! Is this a game of cutscenes? I think it might be. This game is 20 million cutscenes. Whoa! Okay then. That was different. Um, um there must be a way to disable that laser. Yeah, probably. I need to shut down that laser. Laser deactivated it. Right. Anything else I need deactivated? Deactivate. This is easy. Captain, the anomaly and the failure of this station are most assuredly connected. One catastrophe at a time, Mr. Spock. One catastrophe at a time. Whoa, jump. Ah, oh, look at those jumping mechanics. Hey there, Kirk. Are you saying I had to go that way instead? <sighs> Fine then. I'll go that way. It makes you happy. Spock, let's see if we can climb up there. Wait, what? So go fuck yourself. Really? All that way. Don't know how to sprint. Oh my god.
Let's see if we can climb up there after you get half a million miles away. Oh yeah, look, I can climb up there. Whoa! Now what? Ah, uh, anywhere with, so anywhere with a danger logo on, you can climb. Wow, that's um, that's unsafe. Break the door! Whoa! Kirk just came out of nowhere. That doesn't look like decon. Captain, that I would not advise stepping into that scanner. No other way around, Spock. Crouch. I am okay now. Kirk, don't be a moron. Gum. Good. Right. Um, stuff. Ooh, what's this on the wall? Heal. Wow. Oh, that was cool. Hey there, more. Whoa. Captain Kirk of the USS Enterprise, we have a shuttle ready for your evacuation. While we appreciate cool. your assistance, our captain and many of our top scientists are trapped in the transporter room on the other side of the station. We cannot simply abandon them. Any you can. suggestions, Mr. Spock? If we were able to reach them, Mr. Scott may then be able to obtain a manual lock on our positions. I'm afraid that may prove impossible. All interior passages are blocked. Do the suits hold up out there? With the solar shield failing, direct exposure would mean certain death. Well, I hate certain death. Spock, let's try to avoid direct exposure. <laughs> wow, I will that's offer nothing. whatever assistance I can over your communicator. But oh, again, just I close the shield. Efforts... Yeah, yeah, we get it. Certain death. Any other yes, words of advice? Yes, death. Try to live long and prosper. Wow, he just said it. Um, do I want to go out there? Do I want to go out there? Ooh, what's in here? That looks dangerous. Right. Spacesuit. 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 Coat. Yes. Ooh, airlock. That's unsafe. Let's go there. Do, 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 do. Loading screen. Uh, that's it. I'm gonna have a break. Oh! Engage mag boots now, sir. Screw mag boots. Holy shit on a brick! We must avoid direct exposure. That suit is gonna melt off your back. Get into cover, Spock. Captain, we should stay in cover until it regenerates. Wow. Wait for it. Go. Go now. Oh, I can finally sprint. Get into cover. Well then, Captain. Well done. And again, really. I am um, terrible. Oh shit! Kirk, what have you done? What a knob. Whoa! I believe it was yours, sir. Right. Wow, fire. How many times are you going to say that? Oh, 
Ah, you can't get me now, fire. What are you gonna do? Can't get me now. Our combined efforts might open the door. Yeah, help out you know. Well, I'm touching his stomach. Literally, we're back in surgeon simulator, obviously. Lieutenant, we have reached the oh, station's core. Pretty. We seek whatever further assistance you can provide. The only way forward is to shut down the core's rings. Wow. To do this, you will need to work together. One well, that's not going to happen then, is it? The ring. This will allow wow. the other person to engage the locking mechanism. Well, Commander, I must warn you, a manual shutdown under these circumstances is highly risky. Gotcha. Sounds fun. Um, the, 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 just a shooter. No. Okay, then maybe not. Kirk, think fast. Oh. Oh, well, this is no fun. Right, that's enough for now. If I might, I might play this again, maybe they fix stuff. One of us will need to stop until then. So the other can shoot the shut up, Spock. Right, until then. <laughs> yes. Goodbye. <laughs>